Hello, good afternoon, welcome back. I'm Asa Ryan, this is Civ 6, and we are post patch. They've like rejigged the entire game with some huge patch, which is quite cool. So I'm going to have to remember that certain things have changed. Now, there were a lot of exploits in the game that I was trying very hard not to use, such as the ability to sell your units for more gold than you bought them for, um, selling builders, I think, that have had like one or two charges, um, being able to chop down forests. Um, like outside of your territory all that sort of thing has been changed in the game now um we also supposedly can change the names of our cities i mean i don't know if this is a thing can we can we change the name of rome if i go with how do i do that oh yeah here he is there we go we can now change the name of our cities oh wow i've got to come up with some sort of clever idea before i do that though that's the only problem some sort of interesting naming scheme now if you remember the last episode we declared war on russia i think we declared war on russia or maybe we were declared on i think we were going to kill them no matter what but i'm just looking at this I, I, it's been about a week and a half since i looked at this game um I, I recorded a bunch went on holiday and have now come back and I, I'm just sort of looking around and thinking, where, God, where is my army? Like, <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure I have a bigger army. I mean, look, I've got military strength of 1,000 compared to Russia's military strength of 900. I mean, to be honest, it's kind of very similar. I, I don't have that much military. Where is it? What on earth is happening? Um, so, yeah, I mean, our units, our apostles and stuff are being massively <laughs> surrounded here. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what's happened, but anyway, we need to bring our units into the field of play. Um, now, as far as I'm aware, Bratislav, is that Bratislav there? No, Preslav is my city-state buddy. They're giving me many, many, many units of engineering, so that's good. Um, or are they not? No, have they declared war on me? Hang on, Preslav is at war with me. Damn, and the letter is as well. Oh, damn, right, okay, so... There are a few things here that might be a problem. To be honest, taking care of both of those city-states wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Um, now, there is also war weariness to worry about as well. War weariness, I didn't realise how bad a thing it was, but it can be really, really bad. And already we've got zero amenities in Rome. If war weariness kicks in too badly, we might have a bit of a problem, so we've got to keep an eye on that. Let's just dive in. Great people. Who can we recruit? Oh, a scientist! We haven't had a scientist before. Triggers the Eureka moment for mathematics and one random technology from the medieval era. We have that. That would be a pointless great scientist. We're going to pass on him. And hopefully someone else will get him. Scientist, I'm pretty sure Norway will end up getting that great scientist. Save my points for the next one. Should be fine. Uh, we've completed the stock exchange in Rome. We've got many, many bits of gold coming in at the moment. But... I mean, units. We just don't seem to have any units at the moment, which is incredibly cool. Like, like, random. Cool? I could say cool. I mean random. I mean, like, what What the hell's going on? I could get a frigate. I could get a privateer. Naval raider. Naval ranged. Both are good. I might... I, I mean, my Civ 5 brain is telling me get some frigates. So, frigates we shall get for now. Antium, you know what? I'm going to get you to get one as well. Let's just get a little bit of a navy. Kume as well. Yeah, go on, Mankume. You can get myself a frigate. Good. Ravenna. I just want everyone to get me a little bit of, sort of, just unit power. Just so that I feel a little bit safer. I was about to say I could build a frigate on this lake, but this would literally be the only thing in the lake with the letter there, so that probably wouldn't be the best thing. Medic. Can heal adjacent units, support unit. That could be fun. I haven't tried a medic out yet. Let's see what happens with him. Uh, we're going to need some siege weaponry as well. A uh, bombard. I need two nitre to be able to get a bombard up, and I don't have that. Okay, fair enough. I don't have any iron for knights. Really, we are... When it comes to amenities and, and strategic resources, we are pretty naff. Horsemen, for now, we'll have to do, probably. I mean, it's not the best. Apostle, oh my god, is, is declaring war on... Oh, he's being declared war with these Danish people. That's ridiculous. Apostle operates as a medic. Nope. Can adjust... Oh, all adjacent barbarians. Right, if he can survive... I can take over those barbarians, but the Danish are like, they've got their religion in my... Ah, get out. I'm going to have to tell you to stop it. Make demand. No, no, I want to talk to you. How do I talk to you? Discur uh, yep, okay, they're happy for me to get an embassy. That's a good thing. I want to talk to you. I want to make deal. Stop spreading your religion. Can I not do that? Is that not an option? 
Oh, I'm, I feel like I'm missing this. God damn it. Right, fine. Well, whatever. I'll, I'll just have to beat their religion off with my bare hands. Spread evil crab to Brussels. Yeah, and the apostles here. Hang on. Our apostles are going to get killed if we're not careful. But... It, it says it says that my apostle could attack the catapult. I'm not entirely sure how that would work. Just chuck the Bible at it. Why not? <laughs> I don't I don't think that's really what you're supposed to be doing. Um, Novigrod, evil crab. Yes, yes. Here we go. Right. Okay. Our apostles can't really get much further, unfortunately. Just sort of make your way in. Yeah. Why not? That will do for now. Um, no, he doesn't want to move any further, that's fine. Oh, this apostle's being killed. Oh dear, that's not great. Come, come back, heal yourself. Apostle, oh, Tula has been converted, that's good. That's very good, right. Through you come. Let's see if I can get from Novigrad on the other side. Apostle, again, is being just killed here. Not happy with that. Oh, there's a bombard. That's not great either. Uh, Apostle, actually, I can, can I get you to hit really well? No, actually, these upgrades are terrible. Let's just declare war with this Danish guy. Oof! Okay, that Apostle is incredibly strong at conversion. I'm going to need more of these. I'm going to need, need to back up my Apostle army. Okay, I can't afford any more Apostle army. Fair enough. Oh, my spy has stolen something. Oh, no, he hasn't. No, he's gone to Paris. Right, what can I do? Spies operate... Oh, okay, so I can either make him better for next time or increase diplomatic visibility, listening posts. That would be quite good. Let's listen in. Accept in. Yeah, perfect. No, actually, no. I don't want to just skip forward because my units are all on... all on automate here. Hang on, right, so... Here's my legion. I need to just bring my... bring my attacks in because it's not going to let me do it for whatever reason. Heavy chariot... Heavy Chariot, you're not going to get far, honestly. My crossbow can finish you off. I've got a horseman coming next turn. Caesar Augusta? Oh no, not a warrior. Come on. Don't do that. It's quite clear you're not going to win. Augustus Eiffel? Oh yeah, what was he doing? Must be built on a wonder that is under construction. Who was building the wonder? Oh, Antium was going to build a wonder, wasn't it? Um, the Forbidden City? Here, there we go. Now I remember. Now I remember. Rush. There we go. Boof. That's a that's a big rush. Okay, fine. No forget for now. That's fine. James Watt, what were you doing? Build a factory and a workshop. Yeah, that seems about right. Oh, look at that. That's a pretty cool uh, engineering district now. Okay, Portali is doing well. Um, crossbowmen, you need to take care of that heavy war chariot. Actually, you've done that quite well. God, I mean, this scout, I remember now, took my builder. Bang. Um, where are all my units? Jeez. Right, just make your way to the front lines, please. I have no idea where my units are, but this is ridiculous. Um, come on, take care of these barbarians. It needs to happen. God, where are they all? Here's a catapult. Cool. Let me get to that. Anyone see any more? Any more for any more? I think the problem is they're all fortified, and that means I just can't see any of the damn things. Girl. Oh, hello, fellow traitor. You know, you've attacked. That's fine. You're doing your thing. And uh, there's nothing up here. There's just no units. Fine, fine. We'll build more units. That seems to be our priority right now. I thought we had far more than we did. Never mind. Oh, dear. Oh, I've got, a, I've got a relic, though. That's cool. Perfect. Right, my apostles dying to Danish apostles is actually quite a good thing, supposedly. The only problem is that the Dan Danish might start spreading their units, um, or their religion, in my empire. And I don't want that thing in there. Colossus. Oh, it's so golden. It's so brilliantly beautiful. as much bronze it seemed likely to create a dearth in the mines. Okay, well that's lovely, Sean Bean. Oh look, that's clearly me. Look, it's, it's just the likeness of me with Stonehenge on the bottom of it. It's two wonders in one. Stonehenge and Colossus. Brilliant. Oh, and modern era. Ooh, steam power. 
Here we go. We've got ironclads. That can be quite good. Naval melee and coal. No coal. Mobilization. Maintenance cost has been reduced. That's good. Defensive pact. Declare war of territorial expansion. Oh, we're getting we're getting sort of getting modern now. Sort of Lebensraum sort of policy that one. That's probably not the best. Not the best. Never mind. Um, industrial zone bonuses. I'm just sort of refreshing what we were doing. Commercial hub. All of these are pretty good. Uh, triangular trade is a great policy as well. We do need to get a few more trade routes though. That would be handy. Um, what else? So hang on. The new one. We just got a new one. That was two gold reduction. Let's do that. Levy on mass. That sounds good. Yeah. To be honest, for now, that's a good set of policies. Hopefully, I'll get me a bit more gold. Yeah, another 40 gold per turn. I'll take it. I will take it. In fact, I could probably use this gold to get me some decent stuff. Opera and ballet. With, I mean, I'm going to guess that that's probably not what we need. Mobilization. Why Why do we want mobilization? Mm. Oh, yes. It allows us to form armies. Ah, uh, this is it. Conservation. We seem to have boosted that. That's good. Oh, capitalism. We've also boosted that. Let's rock into capitalism. Why not? Great person, great merchant. Oh, here we go. Plus one economic policy slot. That's pretty cool, actually. Where did he go? Here he is. Adam Smith. You must be in a commercial hub. Get into your commercial hub. Activate your effect. Perfect. Another policy slot. I've got an economic policy slot. <laughs> More. No, not going to let me do it this turn. I'll have to do it next turn. In fact, actually, we've got a ton of gold. What other great people could we get? Great merchant. Here we go. Gain 250 gold. Gain two envoys. <coughs> John Jacob. That's not That's not the best. Triggers the Eureka moment for the computer's technology. Did we, I, I thought we had the computer's technology. Do we? Do we? Do we not? I think we don't. Oh, here's computers. Ah, that would get me tourism. That's quite a good thing. <coughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I've got such a fog in my throat today. This is terrible. Okay, right, that's not... He wouldn't be the best. The engineer. Admirals and generals we don't need more of. I'll be honest. Scientist. 500 science on standard speed. For every natural wonder tile here or adjacent. Every natural wonder... Uh, oh, I could take that to the Russian front line. All right, that'll be fairly good. And then writers, artists and musicians. I don't need those at all. All right, then. Okay, there's nothing particularly that I would need. I could get some more envoys, but to be honest, I think at the moment I'd rather use my gold to buy some more troops on the front line. Setia, what can you what can you buy me? In fact, actually, oh my god, units are so cheap. Okay, right, fair enough. That has decided it for me. Look, there's a bit of a Russian Russian attack coming at me at the moment, so uh, a few extra uh, horsemen would be good. I think are they a horseman the most powerful thing that I could be buying as land units or as crossbowmen probably better. Yes, probably crossbowmen to be honest. So let's just buy a few things quick. As in, let me buy more here. Oh yeah, I could buy a frigate. Let's buy one just sort of in this seat so that I can, you know, I can attack from the, well, from a nearby sea. I mean, I could just sort of swoop in this way, bring it round. Maybe that wasn't the best seat to buy it in, but never mind. Veltre, I'm going to let you buy. I don't want a medic really. Hang on, horsemen to here and attack. And the crossbowmen. Good. Fair okay, right, those horsemen are actually fairly good. In fact, I could get. No? Too many of those. No, there's not. There's not too many of those. I've moved the horsemen out. Oh, it's because there's a crossbowman there. Uh, got ya. That was silly. Okay, fair enough. Well, I'll buy it here instead. Horsemen. I could actually. If I get a few horsemen, I can start stacking these up into armies, which would be pretty good. Horsemen are really cheap as well, which is a positive. And they move really fast, so actually, this is all good. I mean, I don't know why I just bought a crossbowman. That was a silly thing to do. Hang on. Horsemen. Yeah, I can buy tons of these. Tons and tons and tons of horsemen. Good. Can London get me one as well? Yes, it can. Good. Any more for any more? Um, yep, Q make these guys can. Actually, just in case the French do decide to attack, mate, I'm just going to quickly stock up my shores this side. 
And Rome, actually, yeah, Rome just got itself a new apostle, didn't it? Or not, oh no, it killed my apostle. Uh, whoops. Hang on. Come on, Rome. New apostle. There we go. Perfect. Done. God, we will fight the Danish religion out. I mean, the, it, unfortunately, it seems to be spreading a little bit, but I think we should be just about all right. 